The tech conglomerate Alphabet already has its footprint here in the metro with three Google data centers on the ground. Their next move is to create an unprecedented broadband network here in Omaha. Six News is on your side as Brent Weber gets us up to speed on the high-speed internet provider Google Fiber. Mr. President. Yes. Item 46 is approved 7 to 0. With that unanimous approval in October of 2022, the political path was smoothed over for G Fiber. Now it's about laying down the future. Yes, Google Fiber is really happening. Construction is underway. It's going to take some time. First customers will see us in the first part of 2024. Google began that fiber installation in the Exarban area of Omaha last week, but the rest of Omaha won't know when it's coming down the pipe in their neighborhood until it does. The project is entirely led by infrastructure and really optimizing for you know, being able to build out as quickly, most efficiently as possible. Here's some of what you need to know. It's about the web, the internet, not content. They're not providing cable channels like Cox, which has been in that market for 40 years and does also provide internet service. More and more folks are doing things online. As you and I are, are chatting online today, this is an everyday experience. We need more bandwidth. Google Fiber or G Fiber is its own entity. Currently, no one in Greater Omaha provides what they're promising. Unfettered high speed internet from one gig to one day five and eight gig at prices that appear to be transparent. On the website, you can already see the figures. We're not going to say we're going to slow your speeds down because we need to share this pipe with the households nearby yours. That gig is your gig. That belongs to you. Do what you will with it. And as for the necessary digging, the build out requires, they are on the record with more promises. You will receive, typically it's a door hanger or some type of notice a couple of days in advance saying you're going to see our crews in your neighborhood. This is what it could look like. If you have any concerns about construction or you want to make sure we are aware of an underground uh, fence, an invisible dog fence or your sprinklers, whatever it may be, there's a 24-7 construction phone number that residents can call. On your side in Omaha, Brent Weber, 6 News. Google tells us it'll take about five years to install fiber across all of Omaha. And we have a link to more information on our website, wowt.com.